438 now and new this morning. Cumulative, cumulative coronavirus deaths in the U.S. could reach more than 200,000 by October. Researchers at the University of Washington now making that prediction as more states begin to reopen. Here's a look at the daily deaths in each state as of today. Here is what it would look like as of October 1st, according to UW. Researchers predict Florida will be among the hardest hit states. Washington state not expected to be as bad compared to the rest of our country. Our state's projected to be well below the national average for coronavirus deaths by October, according to UW. Governor Inslee is urging the Trump administration to implement a nationwide COVID-19 screening system for travelers and aviation workers. Inslee is calling for the federal government to provide protective gear for domestic airlines, temperature and symptoms checks for travelers at the airport, a mask requirement for passengers and workers, and collecting contact tracing information. In a letter to President Trump, Inslee says state and local governments cannot afford it alone, and that's why he wants federal assistance. Amy? King County has applied to move into phase two of the governor's Safe Start plan. If approved, King County could move into the second phase by Friday. Under phase two, more businesses could reopen and they could increase capacity. Kitsap County will be able to apply to move to phase three on Thursday, but first, they want your input. If you live in the county, you have until 10 tomorrow night to fill out an online questionnaire. It asks several questions, including whether you're comfortable with moving to phase three. A special meeting will be held Friday to decide if the county will apply.